Jamie, take us through your week because you've, uh, you've been doing plenty of trips. I've uh, been getting frequent flyer points up, that's for sure. Um, I flew in on Saturday night after the races uh, at Sandown and um, I got to participate in the polo. It was so much fun. Um, I was on Kieran's team and I think he took me out about three times. He forgot I was on his team, but that was a lot of fun and um, good to get amongst everything. Um, then we did the beach gallop on the Tuesday morning. Um, I also did track work here at four and then flew back home to ride Wednesday and do trials um, in Melbourne. So it's been a very busy week now I'm back up here. Life of a jockey, and tell us about your foot. Uh, how's it coming along? You've got a little strap around it there. So what is a little chip, is that right? Yeah, there's a little chip floating around in it, which isn't uh, helping at the moment, especially when horses jump sideways in the gates. Um, that happened last week, which was very painful, but nothing's going to stop me from riding in this race on, on Saturday, so pushing through. Tell us about Sovereign Fun. Wide gate, but right stable. Yeah, look, I was super confident before we saw the barriers. I'm still confident, it's just, um, means I'm going to have to give him a good ride from there. But look, he, he's talented. He's he's um, two from two. Um, I think he's had the perfect prep leading up into this. Hasn't done too much. Um, he's still on fresh legs, which is going to help us. But um, yeah, just where we get from from that draw is going to be the, the tricky one. Thinking about the draw in the track, what is unique about riding on this track here at the Gold Coast? That's a very tricky track. Um, really benefit if you can draw in just because that turn is super sharp and um, you know, it's not very forgiving either so look it's, it's a tough track but he's a good horse and um, it's a good field um, I think it's a very open field there's, there's a few nice horses on the up um, but I think he's going to be peaking at the right time. Tell us a bit about your history in the race you haven't ridden in it for a few years have you? Yeah look what I can remember I rode when Sunlight won I rode the stable mate for Tony and I think I finished second last so um, wasn't a great start for me, but I think he's obviously the best chance I've had in the race. Um, and yeah, looking forward to the day. What would it mean to win it? Uh, it's a it's a very it's an exciting race to win because it's such a build up. Um, there's so many people up here. The race day is fantastic. It, it means a lot um, to win on a, a good two year old and a good colt. I've, I've won a, a few nice group ones on well, not that this is a group one, but you know I've won a few decent races on um, fillies and. and Geldings, but not a colt yet, so it'll be, um, be very exciting. If there was another horse in the race you'd, you'd like to ride, what is it outside of Sovereign Fund, of course? Oh, look, I, I had the, the choice between Croatia and Bell and Sovereign Fund, and I think I made the right choice, but she's a very talented um, filly, and she's honest and tough, and um, I think she's in with a big chance. Um, the Golan, Tony Golan horse has drawn really well, and I think it's going to get a really soft run from there. There's, there's lots of horses that are just peaking at the right time I think so it's going to be a very interesting race. What do you like about riding here in specifically at the Gold Coast in this week Magic Millions week I mean you know you do the hard slog through the winter and then you come up to a meeting like this and so much happening here at the Turf Club lights are about to be put in so what do you love about this week in particular? Yeah well um, us Melbourne people we like to whinge about the weather back home and we come up here and winter's too hot <laughs> um, but it, it's just a it's a great race day it's, um, it's so much excitement and as you're going around the day and um, lovely, lovely weather to go along with it.